friends, welcome to our new channel and our new channel name is Learn English with Ashu. So let's start today's work without wasting any time. Today we are going to teach you different words to say yes. Okay, we always say do you want a coffee? Yes. Do you want to take the tickets? Yes. Yes is much boring. So instead of that we will use the different phrases okay so our first topic is response to a request uh, thing uh, someone asked you that can you submit your assignment by friday so you will say yes i can yeah rather than that you can say of course okay like can you submit your assignment by friday you will say of course i can so that is good instead of saying yes okay so our next question would be, can you meet my mother because I am not at home, okay? Uh, you are going somewhere else and your friend is at the home, neighbor, it's your neighbor. So you will tell him, can you meet my mother, I am not at home. So he will say, yes, I can. But the, rather than that, you can say, no problem or no issues. Because no problem and no issues are same, okay? Sure, I can is uh, basic, so you can understand that. And uh, comment that how many of you can make sentences by sure I can, okay? So, going on um, another topic response to an offer, okay? Response to an offer means uh, whenever someone gives you an offer and you accept that, so you will say yes, I will. So, instead of that, there are some phrases. So. First one is, I, I would love that. Second, you bet. Third, alrighty. Know that alrighty is informal, okay? Uh, I will make one more video about notice writing and uh, other things. Uh, but we will learn that also informal, okay? Next, let's make some questions from that. Hey, I have cricket tickets. Do you want to join me? You will say, yes, I will. So, that's not very good. Rather than that, we can use alrighty or I would love that, okay? Um, you bet is also same as sure I can. It's also basic. Give me some sentences from you bet also, okay? Okay, next topic. Expressing agreement. Expressing agreement means whenever you agree with any sentence, you will agree and you will say, yes, I agree, totally agree, okay? Uh, understand that expressing agreement should be interesting okay so we can use sure was totally or definitely okay first sentence it was a real nice weekend okay instead of yes we can say sure was because sure is you are not sure and was is it is also past so sure was will be the perfect one okay next our company sales gone much higher this week. So you will say, yes, I agree with you. It's not good, okay? Instead of that, we can use totally or definitely, okay? Uh, if, there is, if there is any doubt, you can check to my link. I will give you all the description, okay? And if you have any doubt, you can tell me on the comment box also, okay? Uh, coming up, there are some slang terms. Um, and nowadays... People, uh, people, old people, and children have slang terms a lot, okay? Note that slang terms are also informal, okay? So let's start. Yep. Yep is for uh, children whenever they love something and say, say yep, okay? So this is for children. This is for Teenagers, okay, adults. And this is for all people. Or it is for everyone because uh, this uh, is very common and we can use it very properly, okay? Okay. So, basically, yes, sometimes 
um, old people only do it because nowadays yup and he is on the terrace on the top of the slang terms okay there are some more slang terms but i think you all know or if you don't know comment and in the other video we will tell you some more slang word terms if you want okay for so, till then thank you and bye bye have a nice day